Hello, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all doing well. Over the last few days, I've seen quite a few videos announcing that the HP Reverb G2 is dead. And I'm not trying to troll or go against anybody who's made a video like that, but it is a little bit of scaremongering. And what I'm more slightly concerned with is that people are being advised to stay on Windows 10. Now, Windows 10 is coming towards end of life, full stop, forever. My advice to you people out there, if you're on Windows 10, is to think about upgrading to Windows 11. Windows 11 has been in the wild now since 2021. Why is this a big panic for anybody with a HP Reverb G2? It's because Windows Mixed Reality has been removed from Windows, thus this no longer works but and this is the caveat i want to throw in windows 23 h2 has got support up until november 2025 so what i want to make you aware out there is that you can still use your hp reverb g2 until november next year there is no panic to rush out and sell and get a new headset not yet anyway you've still got till november next year but there's something you're gonna have to do to windows to stop it updating to the latest feature update so you're gonna need to open up group policy editor on your computer i want to throw a quick caveat out there that anything you change here you change at your own risk messing in the group policy editor can really mess up your pc so if you really don't know what you're doing, I don't recommend you go digging in any of the options other than what I'm going to show you. And what I'm showing you is only what I understand myself. And if it's wrong, please comment down below. Um, but this is what I've set up. This is an experiment for myself, so I've never tried this before. And over the next coming days and months, I'm going to make sure I'm still receiving security updates for Windows 11 23 H2. But what you need to do, come into the Group Policy Editor. You're going to be editing the Computer Configuration Policy. So that's this one at the top where it says Computer Configuration. We're going to go into Administrative Templates, Windows Components, and then you're going to scroll all the way down to here where it says Windows Updates. And then we're going to click on the folder Manage Updates Offered from Windows Update. And I've already pre-configured this. So there's two options that you're going to want to change. We want to select when preview builds and feature updates are received. Now you need to enable that policy. I've already enabled it. So double click and it opens this window up here. So what you're going to want to do, you're going to want to click on enable, which will open the options below. And then you're going to need to enter 365 into the box there. That's the 365 days of the year. Then come across, don't click OK, click Apply. And that will apply that setting. So I'm going to cancel that. Then at the very bottom here, there's a feature called Select the Target Feature Update Version. So I want you to double click on that. You're going to come across, you're going to click on Enabled. And then it says, which Windows product version would you like to receive feature updates for? Example, Windows 10. So I'm running Windows 11, so I put Windows 11. And the target version for feature updates is 23H2. Now, to make sure you put the right information in that box, there is a link there to a Microsoft web page which I showed you at the start of this video, which shows all the different versions of uh, <laughs> Windows, of Windows 11. So once you've put Windows 11 and 23H2, click apply and click, well, once you've applied it, apply it. I'm going to cancel out of there. That's all you need to change. And that, as I understand, will keep you on Windows 11 
23H2 up until the point that you do get rid of your HP reverb G2 or someone may even introduce a third party piece of software that makes it work in future versions. So I'm going to wrap this up very quickly. If you are on Windows 10, it is rapidly coming to end of life. You will not receive security updates going forward. You really need to be looking at getting off Windows 10 ASAP. For the HP Reverb G2 to still work up until November 2025, you'd need to be on Windows 11 23 H2. You can't upgrade at the moment to 24H2. So there's life left in the old dog yet. And I hope this video has been useful for at least some people out there who still want to keep using your HP Reverb G2. If this has been useful. Don't forget to give the video a like. Maybe even consider subscribing. It's absolutely free. And I will be seeing you in more videos to come. I know I've been a little absent again, but I am aware the newer set of Corsa, most of Flight Simulator, there's lots and lots of things I need to get back into. So I will be seeing you in future videos. Thanks for watching. Peace out.